I spent two days in Istanbul after four weeks in Cappadocia and I'm not gonna lie, I wasn't the biggest fan. The morning started out well because we went to this really cute cafe and you know it's a good cafe when as soon as you walk through the door, you're hit in the face with a scent of coffee. It was also a really great spot for really attractive guys, but I don't know, they just seemed to be summoned by this cafe. After that, we went to the Museum of Illusions. Now, I don't know why I went to it because I've already been to one in Poland and it's basically the exact same thing. And for 11 pounds and one room, you might not think it's worth it, but we made the most of it. We took so many photos and so many videos and we actually ended up having a lot of fun. Lovely, beautiful weather. Really yeah. vibing. Really nice and sunny. We then took shelter from the awful weather by going in this really cute bohemian hippie shop and I couldn't help myself and I spent £100 on clothes here, but it was so worth it. Then we were hit with two disappointments, which was the Galata Tower, just very underwhelming, and also the Grand Bazaar. We just weren't feeling it, everything was overpriced and it was way too overcrowded. We then proceeded to spend a good hour trying to find a restaurant and settled on this place, which was actually, in the end, really good and we really enjoyed the food. At this point, we were pretty tired and really fed up with the rain, but we knew we had to make one last stop at the mosque, and I'm so glad we did because it was so beautiful and so picturesque. 